All right, welcome back to today's video. In this one, um, we are picking up off a previous one where we created a form. So in this video, we are looking now at um, doing some formatting or some editing to our header section, which is this section over here. Now, in order to do any sort of editing, where do we need to go to? We need to go to our design view. So remember, top left hand corner, we're looking at the view button over there. And we've got our form view and we want to go to design view. So we click on design view and then we have a number of options. So I'm just going to close this. So you'll see we have our header section, we have our detail where everything is in and then our form footer. So I'm just going to drag uh, this down just to give us a bit more space. Okay, so in our form, in our form header, uh, you can see it's that bluish color and here we have test form. Now, what I'm going to do is just two things and we're going to look at the background color and then insert in an image. So if I right click anywhere in the section on that blue, I can go to full back color. So this is the color that it's going to change the background of the header to. Um, you can see I have a number of colors. I'm just going to make it red and you can see that it changes if I go to my form view there it is red over there and again right click full back color and I can go and change it to anything else so that's how we change the background color if I want to test or transform this text you can see the minute I click on it I can click inside to say um, I'm just gonna say this is a picture and you'll see it's got sort of a wrap text on it. That's why it's moving to the next line. And if I click on the outside and it does this where you can see it goes as like sort of orangey color. Um, I can click on that and I can actually drag it around and say that's where I want it to be. And when I go to my form view, that's where it's moved to. Okay, so I can transform that. I can delete that um, through your control buttons. And I'll maybe go through this in a, in a different video. Um, you can go and add a text box so you see I just click there this is in the design tab click on that text box and if I do that then I can type in um, some text but we'll leave that for now so uh, the next part of this is inserting an image so remember I'm inside my header I've clicked in there I've got these three tabs that come up in my design tab next to controls I've got insert image click on it and most of the time, if you haven't done something before, it'll just have browse. So we click on browse and this is where we need to navigate to or go and find um, a picture. All right, so I'm just going to use any picture that I can find here. Um, yeah, let's just use this one. And you'll see it doesn't put the picture inside. What it does is it changes the icon. So now I've got to draw it inside. So I left click, hold it down and I drag. And that's where my picture will be. I can obviously go and move it. I can also um, resize it. Okay, make it bigger, do whatever I need to. And in my form view, that is where I will see it. So this is just how in my form, I can go and add text. I can change the background color and I can even add a picture.